okay. I, I, uh, I didn't even notice, honestly. Do you want to sit down? Oh, yeah, yeah, man. yeah, of course. Do you want me to get that for you? Um, yeah, sure. Uh, what is this? It's tea. Don't you have anything stronger? Uh, I have black in the cabinet or some coffee if you... No, no, I meant like a beer. I don't know, whiskey? Uh, Helen and I, we didn't, I, I don't drink. Right. Sorry. Oh shit, dude, is that the new book? Yeah, that's, um, yeah. You know, man, I'll never understand how you got so fucking lucky. I mean, you were a great writer in high school and all, but... Shit, man. It usually doesn't amount to anything. You know, it's... It's not like what I do, you know? It's... You know, real estate is just very mono a mono, you know? It's... It's just like knowing people, you know? And like, clinching that sale. Yeah. There's not a whole lot of understanding people and... Literature. What's up? I was just saying, uh, I think we actually do have a couple of beers in the fridge. <sighs> Dude, thank God. Listen, thanks for what you said today. It was really beautiful. She would have... She would have liked it. And she would have liked to know that you were there. So, thank you. Dude, of course. Helen meant the world to me. You know that. And you know, it's kind of funny, like, the priest said, well, would anyone like to say a few words? And I haven't really prepared anything. Like, and then all those people started crying. It's just like... It's crazy. Yeah. yeah. Shit, and your eulogy, dude, like, heartbreaking. Like, so good. So good. Really great. Great stuff, man. Oh, thanks. That means a lot. But, you did lie, though, right? Excuse me? Well, I'm just saying, right? You know that part where it's like, blah, blah, uh, what was it like? Um, Hell and I were soulmates, and both, like we were our first loves, you know? Technically, right? I dated her for like, let's talk more fresh, like a year and a half before you even met her? So, technically. <sighs> hey man, can I get another one? Yo, John. Can you get another beer? John. Beer? Jesus. Thanks, I guess. You know, other than that part, man, it's great. But I just, I don't know, it's kind of funny, you know, like, a lot of people don't know that she and I dated like a year before you guys got together. Yeah, funny. Yeah, real fucking funny. I just thought it would be nice if my wife's family and friends knew that I loved her. That she died having married the love of her life, but no! It's fucking funny. Hey man, I'm not trying to take away from that or anything. No, you're not trying to take away from that. You're trying to take away from my fucking marriage. You're trying to make it about you. But what fucking almost was? Jesus Christ, Mark. How do you think Helen and I first started talking? It's because you treated her like shit. Man, that's such bullshit. I liked Helen two years before you even knew who she was. I you wanted to fuck her. And when she didn't do what you want, you fucking ghosted her. 
She came to me because I was the only one who knew how much of an asshole you could be. Here it fucking comes, man. You're holier than thou bullshit. You think... You think you're better than everybody else with your fame, your fucking faggy books? Jesus, man. You, you need everyone to, to just... what? To like me? The only person who works so damn hard to get everybody to like him is you. I just loved her. All I did was love her. What can you tell me about her? All I'm asking for is one thing. Her favorite color. Her fucking dog's name. What colors does she want to go to? Tell me one. You win. Yeah. Okay, you win. Yeah, I know I win. I can't have her, but at least I won, right? At least no one will ever fucking love you. Jesus, John. John, I'm so sorry. Get out of my house! John. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out!